Hi everybody, I'm Caitlin. If you watched my first video, thanks for tuning back in. If this is your first time, welcome. Today I'm going to talk about how to be approachable. I've been a matchmaker here at Matchmaker Select for a very long time now, and that's the number one thing I get asked all the time about. How to be approachable, why is nobody coming up to me, or why is it so hard? Over the years, I've noted a few things that have been the problem and I've also done a little bit of research on the topic. A lot of men have um, suggested some things that women do or reasons why they can't approach women. I'm going to tell you to do is smile. A smile is universal. It lets everybody know, hey, I'm having a good day. Come up to me. I'm approachable and open for conversation. If you are turned away from the person when they are talking to you, you're going to seem like you're not very interested. One tip is to do heart to heart. Stand close to the person so that your heart is facing theirs. It shows you that they have your attention and look right into their eyes. Some people may look away, but it really shows that you're interested in what they're talking about. If you're a woman and nobody's coming up to you or you hear over and over that you're not approachable, maybe take a look at what you're doing. If it's just that you think you're a confident person and that everyone is a little bit scared to come up to you, maybe take charge. If you're that confident woman, good, own that. And maybe go up to the next guy and introduce yourself. It really relieves a lot of stress from them and I think you'll find that a lot more people will be open and inviting to it if you do. Confidence is key. Confidence is good in life, in the workplace, and anything else, confidence is priceless. And so is being approachable. Dating, of course, you want everybody to approach you, but it will also help in every other day-to-day -day life, which will make you feel better, which will attract better people into your life. Ask a friend or family member to watch you and see if you're being approachable. Sometimes we don't know what we're doing and an outsider's point of view could really help with the process. Another thing to take into consideration is if you're eyeing one person up and you have a bunch of people coming up to you as well and you keep denying them, that person is probably watching you and watching what you're doing. So it really matters about how you treat people around you as well. I hope some of these tips have helped you. Please remember you can always submit any questions and I'll come on here and help out or give us a call and we can talk over the phone. Our information is down below. Thanks and we'll see you again.